this is pretty exciting. I scheduled a demo with Tesla, but none of their normal Tesla service centers. This is a new thing they're doing where they put these Teslas just out in the public. These are sitting at a hotel in Ocala and you just schedule it on your phone and you uh, basically go there, pick up the car. Um, you use your app to open the door and you just drive it and there's nobody sitting in the car with you. You just get full access to the car, which is great. Some of the things that Apple asks you for is your driver's license. And of course, since a lot of my stuff is already in my app, it was pretty quick to set it up. Uh, you just have to pick your location, the date you want, the type of vehicle you want. You can uh, choose between the Model Y, which is the small SUV, the Model 3, which is the small sedan, uh, the Model S, which is the big sedan, which is mine, the Model X, which is the big SUV with the Falcon wing doors, or you can select the Cybertruck. Um, you can also do a quick um, demo, which I did, and I'm also scheduled a 48 hour demo, so you can keep the car for two days. Now, the cool thing about the new Model Y is it has the latest uh, version of full self-driving. Right now, we're driving over to get the car in Ocala. So we'll just pop in here and we'll pick up our uh, Model Y at the uh, Hilton up in Ocala, Florida. Now, like I said, they have a Cybertruck here. They have a uh, Model Y and a Model 3. The Model S and the X they have at the Gainesville um, store plus they have you know pretty much any Tesla service center you just get in the car with your app and that lets you inside of the inside of the car now turn as soon right as you sit down the car starts up I just put in the uh, an address like the nearest Best Buy you press the button on the steering wheel and the car just starts driving okay it's definitely driving itself I'm not touching anything be back by 2 o'clock. Hey, hey. So the car is driving itself. There's a really sharp curve right there. Looking both ways. Hey, we can see it <laughs> hey. Driving the new Model Y, the 2026. Now that I'm driving around, I'll see if it's in 500 feet, bear right onto Southwest College Road. Now, it doesn't mind my hand on the camera next to me. It's pretty crazy. So, it does it once. Now, bear right onto Southwest College Road. I'm just a passenger in this car. <laughs> Wow, this is a lot of busyness on that screen. It's doing it. It's accelerating. It's doing its thing. And this is a crazy busy street. Touching the brake or the gas, just so you know. This is so cool. I have not driven this car since I started driving this car. I have not touched the gas or the brake since I started. It's 
doing everything pretty well. I will say the cameras seem to be super crazy high def. It's funny, the Tesla guy's texting me. I'm not supposed to look at the... Okay. I'm surprised he hasn't yelled at me. Attention monitoring unavailable. Apply flight force to steering wheel. Okay, I did. This feels like... I mean, I've been in self-driving. But this is so freaking good. There's no jerkiness. It literally feels like you're being chauffeured by the tight seat or something. Got kind of a cloth material here. more comfortable than a Model S. Well, I say it seems quieter in here than my Model S. There's less wind noise on the glass. That's for sure. Less road noise. Yeah, it is quieter. Is it more comfortable than my S? Seems pretty darn cushy. The wheel seems so much smaller than my ass, which it is actually. Let's apply turning force to the wheel. Alright, good. We did that. I wonder what this standard means right here. Don't don't yank my hat off now. Ah. Pretty remarkable vehicle. I'd like to drive a 2023 and see if it isn't that much different in the quality and the quietness. Come on, don't you want to get over here? Half a mile to the I want to get over in the lane yet. Come on, dude, it's point three miles. Don't you want to get over? In one thousand feet, turn left onto Southwest Thirty Sixth Avenue. Is it going to punch it to get in front? It does. <laughs> Driving kind of aggressively to get over. Wow. This is freaking unbelievable, man. Now turn left onto Southwest 36th Avenue. And it's doing it. Wow. Not doing a thing. In 500 feet, your destination will be on the right. I wonder if because this is a demo, it's giving me more leeway um, to not, you know, nudge the wheel as much, or is this the real? Now your destination speed? is on the right. All right, is it going to let me? Wait, no, 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 stop! It wanted to go right into the, into the 
like a roundabout there. Uh, let me come up here and park the sucker next to the other. Then an animal. Go. Then to hear a song. Part. All right, didn't do anything. Still has the plastic on the screen. This is brand spanking new. It's a beautiful color. But yeah, this is the three. Love that blue though. We got the Y, we got the ancient S, and we got the Cybertruck over there. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe down below.